one of the ways in which Soul Force is trying to live out that idea that there is power in the soul, in the spirit, in the connectivity of our interdependence. Um, is that we are taking on the National Religious Broadcasters, which is the right-wing media hub that reaches about 25 million homes across the world uh, every single day with highly anti-Muslim, anti-women, anti-LGBT um, issues as an explicit kind of understanding and prerequisite for faith. Um, and this year in their whatever senses they must have lost, have decided to have their international conference just minutes away from Pulse and have people speaking at this conference of over a thousand um, that include people who say that Pulse was punishment for the LGBT lives um, that people led, and that was actually God's punishment. So we will be showing up in full force, uh, holding 86-hour vigil in Orlando, Florida, um, building and living altar of resistance that honors those that we lost at Pulse, as well as those that we've lost across the movement. As Alba said earlier, and this is our altar that Charlene is showing now on the screen, um, that is being hosted at Creating Change, um, and that we call our living altar of resistance, that we are building um, together with the force, the sole force of the 3,000 plus uh, queer and trans people and our allies that are here at this conference. And together, we are um, not only here, but also asking folks from all over um, to send doves that they have decorated and imprinted with their messages for Orlando, whether they be of resistance, of power, of mourning, of grief, um, of that life, of hope, of all of those things. And so connecting together our souls and spirits to do that work that moves our spirits up from the ground, the spirits of our ancestors and the ones we've lost and the ones that have come after us um, into that space, that, that NRB space. Um, and so... What does a dove, flock of doves look like that is 3,000 strong, right? Of saying, we are coming in nonviolence, but we will not allow that space to go uninterrupted. We will disrupt that space with our incredible flock of glittery ass, sparkling, queer as hell, not ashamed kind of doves that say like, one dove you may be able to catch. 4,000 doves is a flock of birds that can be quiet and angry at the same time. We're receiving paper doves that will fit in a in a uh, like just regular business size envelope. Have your kids decorate them, your youth group, your women's club, whatever that is, and send them in to be part of the flock of resistance that also honors our dead and fights like hell for the living. So we would love for y'all to be a part of that action um, and to find out more at our website. Um, it's like soulforce.org slash keep pulse alive. We can put that at the little bar. But it's just a way of noticing like what does power look like when it's not there to bring death or harm, but it is absolutely stepping our whole bodies right in the way of the powers that say that we deserve pain or death. Um, and that is about how we show up. So that's one of the ways that we're inviting the whole world to be part of an action that says to those folks who do their harm in the name of a living God that we believe in, that actually that is unacceptable.